need you all to hear what I'm saying. Success is a plan that takes years in the making. When nobody did, I believed. I had to let go of things I did not need. Cut off some friends in the process. What could I say? I could no longer carry the dead weight. Get off your ass. There's lots you can do. You want to learn something and watch how I move. But they don't want to do shit. They want to be spoon fed like a little baby. That shit is crazy, boy. Change up your mindset. I get three days worth of work done in just one. Seven, two, seven. Mindset is the hustle for us. You get it? I'm Alex Corona. And I'm Jamie Burke. And this is the 727 Podcast. Well, we're going to show you how to work three days in one. And how there's hocus pocus in the focus. Today, we're going to talk about the blessings of work. Communication. The only reason why I've gotten better at communicating with people is being around people. A lot of people work from home right now and rarely even see adults or spend a lot of time with their kids. They forget how to even be an adult. Conversations with my kids are definitely my favorite. However, everything that I've learned has been communicating and being around the workplace. I've always worked in retail, some sort of retail, always talk to people, learn from my partners, learn from the community, just having basic conversations, getting yourself out of the house and into a workplace at least a few days a week is really healthy for your soul. Ever since the pandemic, a lot of people chose to just work from home or just not return back to the workplace. And you're really doing yourself a disservice. You know, people that stayed in the office got light years ahead of you right now. And it's very important that you start investing in yourself and getting yourself back out there. You grow to the conversations around you. I have a lot of real estate agents that reach out to me that they're working at other companies. You know, I coach a lot of people in other states as well. And they tell me, you know, I feel like I'm alone. I don't have anybody to, you know, that can help me. And it's because they don't go into the office. They're by themselves. You know, they go to meet somebody, they go to Starbucks or, you know, local restaurant or whatever. You got to get into the office and see what other people are doing. See what's working, see what's not working. Get with the times because there is people in your office that are killing it. What are they doing? That's what you need to be doing. Instead of sitting at home and watching novellas, you know, until whatever time of the day and, you know, hanging out in your underwear, you know, it's time to show up. It's time to take a shower. It's time to shave. It's time to take that shit that you keep wanting to take. Get up and do something. And most importantly, get out, get back to the office, start going outside, you know, go to the park and play with the kids. And when I tell you play with the kids, play with the kids. All these things matter. And talk to the other people that are there. Don't be afraid to pass by somebody on the street and say hello, spark up conversation at the grocery store. If you don't have a workplace to go to, speak to other people outside of their house. You don't realize on how much the lack of communication you can have with the adult world, it actually hinders you and it actually makes you feel a lot more nervous when you're put in that position. I have some friends of mine who are stay at home moms. They're like, man, I love my kids and all, but shit, I need to talk to an adult and have an adult conversation. It's a totally different scale on a totally different scale and it really is just good for you. So I used to be an at home dad and there was weeks and weeks that I would just be, you know, hanging out with my son and his friends and coaching baseball and no adults. The only adult I would talk to was Jamie, maybe occasionally one of the, the kids' parents, but that was even rare. And I started to feel it. I'm like, wait a minute, like all I'm doing is talking to these kids and you know, I need to start getting myself out there and start growing and learning because I started feeling like I started shrinking and, and when you're not growing, you're actually dying. And that's how I felt. Like I was, I was not bringing anything to the table. I wasn't helping myself. I was actually hindering my future because I wasn't getting myself out there. Get out there and mingle. And network because I can't tell you who you know is so much more important than what you know. We love you, we wanna see you win. Get yourself out there, get yourself back to work, get yourself in some adult conversations, and most importantly, with people that know more than you do. Be the dumbest one in the room, just like me. <laughs> see you guys next week, peace. You ought to hear what I'm saying. Success is a plan that takes years in the making. When nobody did, I believed. I had to let go of things I did not need. Cut off some friends in the process. What could I say? I could no longer carry the dead weight. Get off your ass.